<laughs> she tried sucking on my nipple the other day through my shirt. I was holding her like this. She's like, I am the milkman. My milk is delicious. What is up, YouTube? Ian dragged me to the Raw Athletic Club today, so figured I'd go to the Superior of Gym for a leg day. So we're gonna try out some of the new equipment. I've never done legs here. I've only ever done chest and shoulders here. And I've just been secluding my introverted ass in my own gym. So here today, gonna hit some legs, start with some hamstrings. I don't even know what machine we're gonna do next. We're just gonna yeah, pick a new one and go after it. So sure. yeah, that's what we're doing today. <clears throat> Two more. Oh. 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 I swear to God, I sweat more in this gym with AC than I do mine with fans. Just like the wind blowing on me. Yeah. I feel drip coming down my butt crack right now. Yeah, are you doing three here? That was my third. Or do you want to do this thing? The one she's on or the, no, the, the straight one? The, I'm done to try it. Yeah. True squat or like what are they? Is it a V squat or a true squat? I think true squat's the brand of the other one. A drop squat. This is called a drop squat. I think that's just the brand version of it. But um, we saw this yesterday. Looked oh, pretty cool. It's it's heavy for no weight on it, hey? Or am There's I just no weight on it right now? None. Oh uh, yeah. Yeah, it's not just me. So we saw it yesterday, we wanted to try this one out, so gonna uh, warm up here, see how it feels. <clears throat> I mean, even with no weight on this thing, this thing is not like easy. It's not like a Smith machine or like some of the machines where it's like, you can feel that it's like, there's no weight on it. It feels like it's weighted even when it's not. So I'll be interested to see how much we can get on there. Oh, man, my knees are hurting right now. Mine too. <laughs> see, my gym, way better for this. <laughs> where do you even put the weight on this? Right there. Up here? Yeah. I think so. What about this one? No. Both. I think there's two. I have no idea what 125 is going to do to this, so... <clears throat> Alright, that's not too scary. I thought we filled knee <coughs> sleeves in there. Huh? I thought we sold knee sleeves in there. Is there? No. There's some in the warehouse, so I just didn't want to <coughs> walk that far. Maybe. Do you know where they are in there? In the warehouse? Probably. <laughs> XL? <laughs> From the warehouse. <laughs> From the unlimited <laughs> supply in the warehouse next door. <laughs> 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 Mm. 
Your feet are way closer under you than mine are, I think, though. More and more under me? They're more, yeah. Yeah, they feel better. Does it feel better? You're like up here? Not quite that far, but yeah, like kind of there. That's my butt dipped yeah. forward. Yeah, no, it looks worse for you that way for sure. Yeah, but easier on my knees further back. Yeah, I can see that. We need like a sub or something in the gym. The music sounds very hollow. Oh, yeah. You know, it's like. It's a good yeah. We should just take my big JBL speaker and put one like right there and see what happens. What do you think? I mean, we can definitely do five. Yeah. It's either five or heavier. Yeah. We'd probably do six. <laughs> Be here till we're at fucking ten. <laughs> <laughs> probably do six. Probably do seven. Probably do eight. <clears throat> I didn't know if that was intentional or not for a second. I'm like, did he seriously oh. just get stuck on the second rep? That's getting heavier though. It is, yeah. Six for sure. Six will be working for me. Probably. Six will be working for me too. No? No. <laughs> <clears throat> Seven? Yeah. Yeah. It's like a depressing, like. Like we'll beginning of a movie that takes too long to it start, won't fit you know? seven. You put one up top. Oh yeah, it's got the top. All right, I'm working here no matter what. I don't care. No matter what happens. One more. That was eight, like I said. I'm watching the machine like rock. I know, it's fucking wild. Is it meant to have this much weight on it? It's a little bit sketchy. Let's go. Good. Come on. Good, you got more, let's go. Two more at least, let's go. Come on. Control down to the hole. Tight. Good. Last one. Let's go. Brace. Holy shit. I was bottoming out there too. And yeah, I know, I was hitting the bottom too. Me up. It's alright though. I don't love it. I don't love it, but I don't hate it. It forces you to go under your toes when you're starting to die, or my body is. You were, yeah. I mean, that could be why it has this go up like that. But I don't want it going. I know toes. that hurts my knees. Yeah, if anything, you would want this to go on a bit of a decline, so you could be in a bit of plantar flexion. to warm up to like a six plate back squat <laughs> and then do walking lunges and leg press and like <laughs> I used to train the last prep I did for Toronto I had a phase where I was like huge on doing walking lunges I was up so I was walking lunging with three plates really yeah it feels so weird like trying to get down with that your knee stability was probably a thousand yeah Good, come on. Push hard. Six, <clears throat> good. Come on. 
Brace, brace, brace. Apart, go. <sighs> Jesus. Whew. That really exposes <laughs> the weak parts, parts of my leg. Yeah. I can't cheat might, where I normally do. Might be good do. for you. What? Might be good for you. Yeah, seriously. Feels way hotter without a fan blowing on me. I have like sweat just fucking dripping out of me right now. You wanna try the prime? Oh yeah, let's try it. That's so nice. Really? Oh yeah. I don't know what that thing on the underneath is for. Yeah, wait, what is that? I don't understand. It does nothing really. Maybe it's for banding it. It could be for bands. Oh yeah. It's nice though, eh? Yeah. You might need shoes though. What the grading? Yeah. Just kind of flip. Yes, I think it's for uh, it's like this, yo. Yeah? Oh, to band it. So you can like make the bands farther away or closer. It's pretty smart actually. I have to make a comment about this. How many people chirp me for doing reverse banding on hack spots? And this is literally designed for reverse banding. Why do people trip you for that? Because it's like it's like a way to load up a million plates and make it like look more impressive, but it's actually lighter, you know? And I think I get in a lot of trouble for kind of like starting that phase a little bit, you know? Nick DiNardo used to always roast me. He's like, if you're doing it for your knees, it's actually better to attach it to the bottom. Yes. Because you use less load and it's less tension yeah. on your knees. And I was like, whatever. Yeah, but it's a lot cooler when you can put like 12 plates on. Exactly. Take it from a sneaky angle so you can't even see the bands. Yeah. You know? Come on. One more. Oh, fuck. Good. Three. Come on. Four, good. Five, come on. Two more, I got you. Come on. Good, another one. You got one more, let's go. Come on. You wanna go for 10? Let's go, make it count, let's go. Last one. Oh shit. Woo. That was good. Felt alright? I was in my head about to explode. <laughs> it feels heavier than it should. I just have a plate on it. Hack is heavy. But like something about it, it feels so smooth and yeah. it bears you in the hole. It's heavy, yeah. I like it though. It's not my favorite hack, it's not my least favorite. It's somewhere in the middle. I still like the Cybex better. Cybex. Cybex is heavier though. Yeah. I also always use a band on the Cybex. Reverse band. So it feels lighter in the hole. Yeah. This is distinctly heavy in the hole, you're right. Probably why they made it with a li literal reverse band setup on it. Yeah. And I, I guarantee if we did chest now, you'd still be stronger than me. Maybe it's just you. Because I lose all strength when I come off. But you think you'd lose them all equally? Back and legs, I find I retain the most. Say. Arms is such a small group. There's like sm a small variance of loss. Yeah. But like close grip or something, sure. But then that's back into pressing movements. But like overhead pressing and bench pressing, incline pressing. I can see I lose a lot in chest. Yeah. Like I actually don't think I could incline bench three plates for eight right now. And I've benched five plates incline for eight before. <laughs> you know? I spotted you. Yeah. You did that at Mobadi once, I think. I did it at Mobadi. I did four and a quarter, four to 35 for like eight or 10 at Mobadi, yeah. But like, I couldn't do that for us. I would literally ex explode if yeah, I tried to lift four plates. 
You've also stopped training like that for a long period of time. Especially my pressing, yeah. <clears throat> good. It's freaking good. Four. Four. Come on. Good. Good. Come on. Died on me. I wasn't sure if you were doing an additional quarter no. there or if you lost it. Good. Come on. Keep it moving. Let's go. Finish. Bradley's been absolutely sassy lately. Fucking just hollering. She was pissed at me today. Just screaming at the top of her lung and looking at her trying to quiet down, just screaming. See, I'm not around babies enough to know like what a fussy day or not fussy day for them are. Yeah. And I know they're all different. Like I didn't think she was ever that bad. Even today when you guys really? were like, holy cow, she's so bad. I'm like, I feel like when I'm around babies, they're way worse than really? that most no. of the time. Yeah. I'm spoiled then. Yeah. She was, I couldn't get, if I can't get her to stop for 10 minutes and her face starts to turn blue like that. Yeah. But she couldn't breathe. She <laughs> Hysterics, yeah. She's just so small and dainty that her cry is still like not so aggressive, you know? Yeah. I don't know what it is though, when it's like I'm holding her and she's crying like that and I can't get her stop. My cortisol is I'm, stresses I start sweating, out. I'm like I can understand that. I put it down and I'm like, fuck. Yeah. You just want anything to like make them feel better and get them to stop. Yeah. And every time Courtney's like, this is what I deal with all day. <laughs> I'm like, I know. Yeah, I know, fuck, thank you. <laughs> what? Huh? She tried sucking on my nipple the other day, through my shirt. I was holding her like this, she's like, like easy. Have you guys seen the movie Ricky Stenicky? Uh, you should watch it. Maybe think of that. An Adam Sandler movie or something? No, it's a new movie with uh, uh, Zac Efron, uh, John Cena, uh, Andrew Santino. It's a comedy oh. of like three buddies that when they're young, they make up this like fictional character called Ricky Stenicky is like an out for everything. Yeah. It's like they get in trouble. It's like, no, Ricky, Ricky did it, you know? And they carry that on into their adult lives of like when their wives will like want to like go to a f event, they'll like go leave to go to the Super Bowl and be like, Ricky's dying of cancer, you know? Yeah. <laughs> and then it ends up being that there's a event, like one of them's having a kid and they need like Ricky to actually be there in person for once. It's like ever the family's like really putting pressure on it. Yeah. So then they hire this like drunk idiot who's John Cena. To he's be like Ricky. a drunk comedian, you know, or an actor that they met in Atlantic City to come play R Ricky Stenicky. And it's like, he's fucking hilarious. But there's one scene where they're in the hospital having the baby and he's like holding the baby with his shirt. And then the, the, the mom's like, the fuck are you doing? Put your shirt on. He's like, skin to skin contact for body. The baby starts sucking his nipples. Dude, She's John, like, what John the fuck? Cena? Get the fuck. No, it's uh, Andrew Santino. Uh. <laughs> One more. Oh my God. Yeah. 
Got the superset seated hand curl with quad extension. Sure. I'm too impatient with workouts now. After I'm here for an hour and a half, I'm like, I need to get the I, I feel that. Here. Unless it's the only time I've left the house that day. And then I'll be like, all right, I'll milk it. And I'll be here the whole day. Yeah. <laughs> I don't know. Uh, but trying this new NewTek one, it's a pretty nice uh, extension. You can adjust the seat pitch from the back. So accentuate the stretch. Um, I know stretch media hypertrophy is under much controversy right now, but it still feels nice, so. Controversy? Yes. Really? Yeah, well, so for certain muscles. Popular. Depends, well, that's why it's controversial, because oh. it's popular now. I think it depends on the muscle, and people apply lessons <clears throat> they learn for one on all, you know? <clears throat> oh, what muscles aren't good for it? Like, say, the triceps. Oh. Where, like, only part of it that only crosses the elbow joint, not the shoulder <clears throat> joint, so, like, it doesn't really make sense. <clears throat> I don't know. I'm not a fucking. I'm not an engineer. Oh my god. I got nothing left there. Machine is not built to do calves with no shoes on. Could, but I'm a little biatch. You ever see a calf machine with a round foot stand, like a cylinder? Ten out of ten. Use it even if it's arm day. Lots. <laughs> Probably should put shoes on for this, but definitely. <laughs> 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 Pretty light stack, eh? It's lighter than I expected it to be with it. For oh no, it's because it's, the yeah. big ones, yeah. <laughs> I'm like, there's a lot of weight left on there. Yeah, I know. <laughs> that rickety machine. Yeah, I know. <clears throat> Put this thing on my ass. Jesus. This is a hazard. What? I almost sat on this. Why don't you use the proper time? I'm not drinking this. Do you think I'm an animal? I wouldn't even give this to Poppy. Poppy only drinks Mountain Valley spring water out of a glass bottle. 
I'm not going to be disgraceful and rinse my bottle at with Voss. That'd be a little aggressive. If you guys didn't know, Voss water is three and a half times more anabolic than any other kind of water. But only if you drink it post-workout. Typically have carbs post-workout, but I was a little hungry, so I had an intro workout. So, no post-workout carbs for me. I'm gonna chug down a double scoop of dark chocolate, go home, make some pasta, and refuel, because I'm cooked right now. It was a good leg day. I still like my gym better just because of the ambiance. It's bright, it's hot, it's warm, but the equipment here is fucking way better than my gym. So, what's, it, what's that saying? Two sides of the same square? This way or that way? One way or the other? Either way, that's it. We're training four days in a row because we were filming something tomorrow, which we haven't talked about, so I'm not gonna say what. So, yeah, I got my brain's dead. I haven't slept properly in like two weeks. And I can't even blame Bradley, it's just my body. Since I was talking to Courtney about that. I think it's been 2016, honestly, to be fair. My, do you know what my HRV is right now? I don't, I don't know, have my I don't know what HRV is. I don't know well, people who are watching this know, and my HRV right now is a 29. What's HRV? It's the time between heartbeats in your sleep. So like the slower your heartbeat is, with the longer rest in between your heart rate, shows that you have less cortisol, less stress, you're better rested, you're more able so to train the hard. Better. The higher the number, the better. Because it's a length of time. So like Jansen and Dom are like 110. David Lade's like 105, mine's 29. So, love that. You have to wear like a Whoop or an Apple Watch or a Garmin or whatever. But yeah, that's it. So, I'm gonna go home and eat because I need some carbs, so.